Hi YouTubers, this is part 4 to my DVD slash VHS collection. Let's just jump right on in and I'll start right here. Spider-Man 2. I did have uh, part 1 also uh, back in 2007 but I pawned part 1 and 2. And, but I got this one for I think I, I think I got this at Christmas in 2009. Got it for Christmas in 2009. So, and also this is not my favorite Spider-Man. The first one is. Really don't like the third one, but I'm planning on uh, getting it anyway. Here's Momento More. It's put out by Tartan Asian Extreme. It's the Part 2 to the Whispering Corridors. Bought this off of Amazon for used. And I'm pretty sure it came from a video store. Because it's got that uh, Hollywood video right there. The little label thing. It's got all these stickers also on it. And here's Whispering Corridors, the first one. This is one of my favorites out of the series. Uh, this one, part three and part five. Well, also, when I got this, it was that top was messed up. So, yeah, it's all right. The movie plays fine, so I'm okay with it. Here's phone, also from Tartan Asian Extreme. Really good movie. That kid right there is a really good actress. If you like Korean horror movies, check this out. Check this one out. Also, the uh, these two are also Korean horror movies. There's another Korean uh, thriller slash horror movie, I guess you can say, and it's Tell Me Something. Bought this used off of Amazon and it came without a slip cover. A really good movie. Check it out. There's a Japanese horror movie, Another Heaven. It's really out there. It's kind of hard to explain, but it's a really good movie. First saw this on TV. Another Japanese horror movie, The Booth, also put out by Tartan Asian Extreme. Really good movie. It's really short, 74 minutes long. But really good movie. Check it out. Here's Dark Water, the original Dark Water. Uh, it's not that crappy American Dark Water that remake uh, the only bad thing about this is the ghost right there right there the makeup for her looks really crappy it looks like clay but I can look past that and, and all that good stuff and the story's really good and the acting's really good but that's the only bad thing about it but really good movie Ringu Pretty sure everybody's heard of this or at least seen the American remake The Ring. Yeah, see? If you like The Ring, you love Ringu. When I first watched this, I didn't really like it that much. But when I, bu I bought this before and I watched it, I didn't like it. And when I pawned the Spider Man movies, I pawned this one and a few. Well, I pawned all my movies. But, yeah. I bought this from uh bought this one from uh, Big Lots and I rewatched it and I was like, well it ain't that bad. There's Juan the Grudge special four D V D set. Yeah, it includes all four films in this complete saga. That's Juan the Curse. Juan the Curse Two. That's supposed to say Juan the Grudge, not Juan the Grudge Two, and then Juan the Grudge Two. 
This is the only way I know how to get the uh, these two movies right here. The, the Curse and The Curse 2. Also in this set, uh, the first one here, the, the audio is off. Really bad. But that's the only bad thing about the set. So I'm planning on buying Juan the Grudge. Like, separate. Where I can, you know, have it where the audio is, you know, right on cue. But all four movies are good. Check them out if you like Asian horror movies. Let's see. It's Crazy Lips. I showed this in my DVD update. It's a Japanese horror movie, just like the past, like Juwan's a Japanese horror movie, Ringu's Japanese horror movie. I think I forgot to mention that when I had to, when I was showing them, but this is one of those off the wall movies. There's a lot of rape and nudity. What? Well, there's not really a lot of nudity, but there's some in it. It's really crazy. But there's a really good fight scene in this movie. And also, the FBI agents in this. Like that later right the blonde head one, Lucy. Really funny. Check it out if you like crazy movies. But me personally, I think this one's better than Gore from Outer Space. It's the sequel to Crazy Lips. I think the acting's better in it. The story's better, even though the story's a little off also. But really good movie. The two FBI agents are in this one also. So check them out. If you like those type of movies. Here is J Horror Anthology Legend. Six episodes of horror. Yeah, I like this one a little better than the other one. Like She Bear and Heartbroken Trip and Lost Souls. Really good episodes on this. If you like anthology movies and also Asian horror movies, check it out. And here's the second one. I think. And it's Underworld. This one really does not have any good episodes, I don't think. Uh, I don't really remember. But, yeah. Bought it used anyway. It's my Tommy collection. I also showed this in my DVD update video. This has the first five Tomei movies in it. Tomei, Tomei Another Phase, Tomei Replay, Tomei Rebirth, and Tomei Forbidden Fruit. Most of these are good. Even the guy that directed uh, Juwan and, and The Grudge 1 and 2, the American remakes, also directed Tomei Rebirth. Where is it right there? So check them out. Okay, this is the uh, Kaladokawa Horror Collection. I'm pretty sure I said that wrong. It has four, four movies in it. I don't want to butcher the names. I could say Shadow of the Wraith, though. And that's a really good one. I like that one. And that one's alright. But that one's not a horror movie. It's more like a drama, romantic drama type movie. But it's alright. It comes in like slim. You know, slim cases. There's two discs in each case. Marbito. I show. Put out by Tar Tartan Asian Extreme. When I first saw this movie, I loved it. I rewatched it. I don't think last year, but the year before. Really didn't like it that much that time. I actually fell asleep during it. That's probably because I've seen it so many times. But yeah, it's okay. Give it a watch if you're into crazy movies. It's one of those strange ones. Okay, here's Art of the Devil 2. I'm all, I'm almost at 10 minutes and I've still got more to show. <laughs> but it's Art of the Devil 2 here. It's, it's about black magic. Also, I just want to say, there are, there's three parts to this. Art of the Devil, you know, this one, and Art of the Devil 3. And these are also uh, Thai horror movies. 
and uh, let me think here what I'm trying to say. Okay, the first one has nothing to do with this one. The third one is basically the sequel to this one. In Thailand, uh, you know, this is named something different from you know from the first art of the devil. But the part three is basically what I'm trying to say is part three is the real sequel to this one. So this will be part one. And then part three is actually part two. And the first one has nothing to do with the rest of them. That's probably why I don't like the first one. But check it out. If you like Asian horror movies. And uh, here's my Godzilla co seven movie collection right here. Comes with the uh, all seven movies come with the English versions and also the Japanese versions. The movies that come in this are Godzilla, King of the Monsters, Godzilla Raids Again, Martha vs. Godzilla, Ghidra the Three Headed Monster, Invasion of Astro Monster, All Monsters Attack, and Terror Mega Godzilla. I don't know if you can get the bottom two now by themselves like you can the, the top ones right here. Like I said right here, available only in this set. Also, if you want to get this, I would highly suggest you to go to Amazon and get it for $25 now. I bought this for 45 So, go to Amazon. Get this for $25 if you want it now. And also have uh, Godzilla Final Wars. has really good monster fights in this movie. Godzilla 2000. It's alright movie. I went to a theater and watched it when it came out. Godzilla vs. Mega Godzilla. And Godzilla vs. Mega Gears. This movie has probably one of the most one-sided battles in all the movies. And next are my anime series. I have Gravon Z. It's the it's season two of Gravon. This also has something like that, like that uh, the Godzilla collection had that that was on the back here. I took it off and put it somewhere else. Also, the the case is really hard. It's three, you know, slim cases. Only three DVDs. There's rumbling hearts. It's an alright anime. Comes with two. Also, this outer case is really flimsy, and it feels like you know if you it feels like if you barely touch it, it's gonna tear. But yeah, and Peach Girl, a complete series, really good anime. Highly recommend if you like anime, like comedy, ro romantic comedy anime. Check this one out. Really funny, really good. And last, they have Steam Boy, which is from the, the director of Akira. This is also the, the director's cut. Has a has some fe special features there. It's no movie. I didn't like it the first time I watched it. When I watched it on DVD, this DVD, I liked it. Also, I want to say that at Big Lots you can buy anime now. So if you have a big a Big Lots near you, go check to see if they have any anime. That's where I got this from, and then a few of my other anime movies. And also, thanks for watching. This is my complete DVD collection. I think I have 99 movies, not counting the anime series or the TV series I have. But, thanks for watching. Bye.